A Fayetteville family bought an RV after their home caught fire with plans to use it as a temporary place to live. They say the RV they bought from Camping World has been nothing but a problem in the year they've had it. Five on your side's Keely Arthur explains what's gone wrong. Some of the problems are electrical. Lights turning on and off by themselves, a hydraulic jack that started on its own and won't stop. And for a family that just lost their home to a fire, those electrical issues have only added to their anxiety. Ben Hutchins' home is boarded up after a fire in August of 2021 forced his family out. It's been challenging, trying. The Hutchins bought this one-year-old RV from Camping World and quickly made it into their new home while they waited for the fire damage to be repaired. We got it and it was immaculate inside. What do you think? This is so <laughs> but the Hutchins say they soon started having problems. A lot of the times you come in and all the lights are going crazy. Like in this cell phone video Ben Hutchins took. The same thing happened while we were there. Oh, there go the lights. Is that so that's it doing its thing. The Hutchins say electrical outlets don't work and the hydraulic leveling system malfunctioned. I literally I smell something. We were sitting outside one time and it just went uh, up in the air and it didn't shut fire. off and we had to call the fire department. They took video of that too. Isn't that weird? That motor is going to burn up. I mean, it's smoking now. There were other issues, but the Hutchins thought they'd prepared for them. We got the best warranty that they had because we didn't want to have to worry about anything. Like, what is going on right now? However, even after the repairs, the Hutchins say electrical issues continued and new problems showed up that the new service plan didn't cover. This is all rotten, completely rotten. Less than eight months in, the Hutchins sure. wanted uh, out. We've contacted Camping World, we've contacted manufacturer, we've, we had, a, we had a, a, an attorney that was dealing with this. The Hutchins service agreement appears to show a 12 month manufacturer's warranty on the camper and their attorney cited that pushing for a replacement or a refund under lemon law protections. But Camping World said that warranty expired before the Hutchins bought it and the RV was sold as is. Five on Your Side has had multiple conversations with Camping World about the situation. We asked multiple times for an official statement, but haven't gotten one. The Hutchins are still worried about the electrical system and are considering taking a hit on their credit and having the RV voluntarily repossessed. It just seems so unfair. We didn't. That's not what we purchased. As for the extended service plan the Hutchins bought, that covers repairs, but there's no option to replace the RV if the problem can't be fixed. A reminder to know what warranties and extended service plans cover before you purchase them. Keely Arthur, five on your side.